So I've been avoiding BuzzFeed for a while, mainly because they have way too much cancer to cover, and I'm afraid of getting in copyright trouble. But I couldn't resist this one. It features Ryan Casada, aka the trans man who sold his soul to BuzzFeed. Take it away, Ryan. That's a rather pretentious, condescending title, don't you think? Plenty of men don't use the urinal at least some of the time. What do you think the stalls are for? There are plenty of short men who aren't transgender. Are you honestly implying that only trans men can be short? There are also trans men who are the average height for a man despite being born female. So as I was just telling my sister, I'm sorry, sorry, not my sister. People get mixed up in pronouns for everyone, regardless whether they're trans or not. Yes, it may be a little harder and occur a little more with trans people when they first transition, but eventually people get used to it. Also, wouldn't this happen with trans women too? <laughs> not my sister. Uh, can I have a... a hun? Hun, there is no way you were 21. There are plenty of people who look young for their age. It doesn't just happen to trans people. And the only reason Ryan looks so young is because he chose not to go on hormones, which right off the bat seems a little suspicious to me. If Ryan actually went on hormones, he'd probably start to look his age. This has to be fake. I'm 22. Yeah, okay. No one binds with ace bandages. It's very dangerous. And essentially every trans man knows by now not to do it. But anyway, I'll give binding to you, BuzzFeed, as it's the only thing so far that pretty much only trans guys do. Yes, technically some biological guys with gynecomastia bind too, but I'm being really nitpicky here. So Emma, do you want to come to my place later? <laughs> yeah... Uh, about that. First of all, this happens to trans women. Second of all, even if it isn't the fact that you're trans, there are plenty of people who have to disclose something to their partner before they have sex, like if they have an STD. So, uh, do you want to hang out sometime? Aww, Ryan, you're so cute. <laughs> plenty of men get called cute by women. I don't know why BuzzFeed thinks this is a trans guy thing. In fact, I've never heard of any trans guys actually getting called cute. <laughs> what the hell is that supposed to mean? So I'm glad that video was only about a minute long. So yeah, that's typical BuzzFeed spreading straight out lies about trans people. I hope you enjoyed this video and thanks for watching. Well,